The journey to making humanity multiplanetary is filled with both triumphs and setbacks. Each step forward is hard won, and every challenge faced is a lesson learned on the path to the stars. In the early hours of November 21, 2025, SpaceX's Starship program faced a major hurdle. The world watched as anticipation turned to concern, underscoring just how high the stakes are in the race to build the future of space travel. Booster 18, the first of the Advanced Block 3 design, was set to power Starship Flight 12, until disaster struck. This booster represented months of innovation, new engineering, and the hope of pushing Starship's capabilities further than ever before. Instead of a launch failure, it was a ground test anomaly, a violent explosion during testing at the Massey's site. The blast sent shockwaves through the facility, instantly halting operations and raising urgent questions about what went wrong. This wasn't just a lost rocket. It was a pause in SpaceX's rapid progress at Starbase. The setback forced teams to stop, reflect, and reassess their approach, putting a temporary hold on the momentum that had been building for months. The incident is a stark reminder that developing rockets at this scale is risky and complex, even for SpaceX. Every new design brings unknowns, and even the most experienced teams can be caught off guard by the smallest oversight or unexpected event. Starship's development is all about pushing hardware to its limits on the ground to avoid failures in flight. These rigorous tests are designed to expose weaknesses before they become catastrophic in the unforgiving environment of space. The loss of Booster 18 tempers recent optimism, forcing a recalibration of timelines and a renewed focus on core systems. Schedules are adjusted and priorities shift as engineers dig into the data to find answers. For the Starbase teams, the mood shifts from celebration to problem-solving. The setback becomes a rallying point, uniting everyone in the shared mission to overcome adversity and return stronger. Every test, whether a success or a failure, is a step toward the ultimate goal, frequent, reliable, and affordable spaceflight. Each setback is a building block, shaping the future of interplanetary travel and bringing us closer to Mars. Now. The focus is on understanding what went wrong and ensuring it never happens again. The lessons learned here will echo through every future launch, fueling the relentless drive to reach new frontiers. Booster 18's demise was sudden and dramatic, catching even seasoned engineers off guard with its sheer violence and speed. At precisely 4.04 a.m. during what was supposed to be a routine gas system pressure test, the lower half of the booster, specifically its massive liquid oxygen tank, ruptured in a violent blast that echoed across the facility. Importantly, no propellant was loaded, and the engines hadn't yet been installed. This wasn't a launch gone wrong, but a catastrophic structural failure during ground testing, a stark reminder of the risks in rocket development. The force of the rupture sent debris flying, leaving the prototype a mangled wreck just a day after its rollout and scattering hardware across the test site. Early evidence points to a failed composite overwrapped pressure vessel, or COPV, deep inside the main tank, a critical component designed to safely contain high-pressure gases. The initial COPV failure likely triggered a rapid chain reaction, overwhelming the LOX tank wall and causing a catastrophic breach that the structure simply couldn't withstand. This isn't the first time, just months earlier, a similar COPV-related explosion destroyed Ship 36, highlighting a recurring vulnerability in these early prototypes. The loss of Booster 18 is a major setback, delaying Flight 12 indefinitely and pushing any realistic launch date into late spring 2026, if not beyond. This setback also stalls the activation of Pad 2 at Starbase, since Booster 18 was essential for ground system commissioning and critical infrastructure tests. In the aftermath, SpaceX crews moved quickly to clear the wreckage, meticulously documenting the scene and beginning a thorough analysis to pinpoint the root cause. Their approach remains the same. Clear the site, learn from every failure, and prepare for the next attempt. In the world of rapid iteration, momentum never stops, even after a dramatic setback. At SpaceX, failure isn't a disaster, it's a data point. The philosophy is simple, test, fail, fix, repeat. By pushing hardware to failure on the ground, SpaceX uncovers weaknesses before they become costly launch mishaps. This rapid, iterative approach contrasts with traditional, slower, aerospace development. 
the wreckage of Booster 18 is a goldmine of information directly informing future super heavy designs. With two similar COPV failures in one year, engineers now have multiple data points to isolate the root cause. Whether it's a manufacturing flaw or a pressurization issue, solving it is now the top priority. SpaceX's history is built on learning from setbacks and evolving quickly. The only true failure would be to stop innovating. With Booster 18 lost, the spotlight shifts to Booster 19. This next Block 3 booster is under assembly at Starbase, now the critical path for the program. Lessons from the recent failure will be built into B-19, likely with COPV and structural upgrades. Even with a rapid push, stacking and testing will take weeks, making a spring 2026 flight the earliest possibility. An older Block 2 booster exists, but it's not suitable for Flight 12's objectives. The mission's purpose is to validate Block 3 upgrades, so waiting for B-19 is essential. Meanwhile, Ship 39, the upper stage for Flight 12, continues its own test campaign. This parallel processing keeps progress moving even as setbacks occur. When B-19 is ready, Ship 39 will be waiting, poised for the next big leap. As SpaceX tackles Starship's challenges, the commercial space race is heating up, drawing in new players and fresh ideas. Starlab, led by Voyager Space, is emerging as a key successor to the ISS, backed by global partners and major investment from around the world. Starlab's collaborative model contrasts with SpaceX's vertical integration and it's racing to meet NASA milestones for commercial space stations. The rise of Starlab and Blue Origin's orbital ambition signals a maturing, competitive market for private space infrastructure. SpaceX's Falcon 9 slashed launch costs, enabling this new era of orbital infrastructure and commercial opportunity. Now, the race is about building the destinations and logistics for a permanent human presence in space. For science and industry, Starship's promise, to keep SpaceX ahead by making massive affordable launches routine for the next generation of explorers. Despite delays, Starship's vision remains bold. The next big goal, full reusability, including a precision booster catch by Mechazilla. Achieving this would revolutionize rocket operations, making rapid reuse a reality. Another milestone on-orbit propellant transfer, vital for NASA's Artemis lunar missions. Success here is essential for landing astronauts on the moon in 2028. Starship's massive payload capacity could transform everything from satellite deployment to building orbital habitats. The journey will be long with more tests and inevitable setbacks. Each flight, starting with Flight 12, is a step toward this future. The explosion of Booster 18 is a reminder of the challenge, but not a change in course. The story of Starship Flight 12 is one of resilience a testament to the unwavering spirit that drives humanity to reach for the stars, even when the odds seem insurmountable. Booster 18's failure isn't the end, it's a lesson in the middle of the journey. Every setback is a crucial chapter in the ongoing saga of innovation, teaching engineers and dreamers alike what it takes to move forward. Progress in space is never linear, it's a cycle of bold attempts and determined recovery. Each launch, whether triumphant or explosive, is a step toward mastery, a necessary risk on the path to greatness. SpaceX's rapid response and shift to Booster 19 show a culture built for innovation, not fear of failure. The team's ability to adapt, quickly, learn, and rebuild is what sets them apart in the relentless race to space. The path is tougher now, with timelines slipping and pressure mounting. Every delay brings new challenges, testing the resolve of everyone involved, but also forging a stronger, more capable team. Yet, this is the nature of rocket science, immense complexity, high risk, and relentless pursuit. The margin for error is razor thin, and every detail matters when reaching for the unknown. Each failed test is an investment in future reliability and safety. The data gathered from every mishap becomes the foundation for future success, ensuring that each flight is safer and more reliable than the last. Booster 18's legacy will be the lessons it provided, not its destruction. Its story is one of progress, of knowledge gained through adversity, and of the courage to try again. The focus is on the future, on assembling B-19, flying Flight 12, and pushing toward new milestones. Each new booster is a symbol of hope, a fresh opportunity to break barriers and redefine what's possible. For SpaceX and Starship, the work continues, undeterred and more determined than ever. The journey is far from over, and with every challenge faced, the dream of reaching new worlds comes closer to reality.